Hey guys, Mark here. I hope you're doing well. In the previous video, I demonstrated the basics of lashing together packages. In this video, I'm going to show you the simplest way that I know of setting up a lashing for a package. Lashings are used to secure a package in order to prevent it from falling apart, but they can also be used to send out packages via mail or you can even use them to set up gifts. With this said, let's jump right into it. So first off, let's take a look at the lashing that we're going to do. So at the top you can see a nice little crossing here. We have a reef knot here on one of the sides. And the bottom is also tied together like this. Now let's move on to actually tying this lashing. To lash this package, I'm going to take some cordage and I'm going to place it under the package. So like this, at about the center point. Then I'm going to bring the two ends up. So up. And I'm going to cross them in order to create a hitch. So something like this. Then using one of the ends, I'm going to wrap around horizontally around the package. So I wrap around and I come up at the other side. At this point, we have two cords that we can finish in a variety of ways. I'm going to use a simple reef knot. So first I tighten up my lashing. So tighten everything up. And as you can see, this left strand is going over my right strand. So over. Then I'm going to wrap it around like this, creating a half knot. Then using this strand, so the one on the right, I'm going to pass over the left strand, so over, then wrap around, like this, then tighten up. And what I get is a reef knot that secures the lashing. And an up close demonstration of the reef knot just in case. So the left strand goes over the right strand. Then we do a wrap around around the right strand. This creates a half knot. Then using our right strand, we go over the left strand. Then again do a wrap around, like this, and tighten up. And what you get is a nice looking reef knot. Now at this point we're pretty much done with our package. For home use, a reef knot is more than enough. But if you're going to send out such a package through mail, you may want to further secure the reef knot. To do it, we usually just add a loop and then feed the working end through, creating an overhand knot. We tighten it up as close to the reef knot as possible. And then do an overhand on the other side as well. So again I make a loop. Then I feed the working end through. Then tighten up the overhand knot. 
and this way we secure the reef knot so that it won't come undone if our package gets moved around a lot. So guys, at this point we came to the end of this video. This sort of a lashing is simple to do, yet practical, and I hope that you will apply it well. Thank you for joining me, and see you next time.